For a web development assignment with a tight deadline, I decided to venture into the world of Scratch. Inspired by nostalgic memories and a few YouTube recommendations. So I decided to make a Scratch game. Yeah you might be wondering a Scratch game isn't a website, so I made a plan to make a simple website and host my Scratch game on it. Our requirements in the assignment for how the website should be built was not too difficult to make so I could easily finish it. At first I wanted to create a roguelike binding of Isaac style game. I came up with the script of how I was gonna generate random rooms based on a pre-made rooms but I ended up stopping it after a while as I delayed the project to try and work on other assignments I have been bombarded with leaving me with about two days left to finish. Around this time I found a short for a roguelike survival shooter idea, like Vampire Survivors. Steal this game idea number one. So one of Vampire Survivors big innovations was to take the top down shooter and remove the aiming. So I thought what if we did the opposite and took away the movement and only had the aiming. The gun pushes you back with the recoil and so you can use this to move around while also trying to blast enemies and decided to change my game concept to this to play around with it. I made some quick website tweaks, ensuring everything was functional, and then delved into creating the shooter game. It was a sprint, and I couldn't implement all the features I had in mind. Using the Turbo Warp Packager, I converted the game into HTML and added it to my website. Despite the time crunch, I managed to secure an impressive 92% on this assignment. I also launched an updated version of the website for anyone to try and play the game. Anyways thanks for watching bye guys.